Right now, Hurricane Milton is intensifying in the Gulf, but many people in Florida and North Carolina are still recovering from Hurricane Helene after it made landfall less than two weeks ago. First responders are searching for missing people, assessing the damage and then providing resources in some of the hardest hit areas. A Central Texas firefighter is amongst that group and our own Bailey Bates spoke with him to get some perspective. Bailey, what did he tell you? Chris Lindsay, Colleen Fire Battalion Chief Flip Bannister specializes in technical search for Texas A&M Task Force 1. And he's deployed with them many times. He tells me Hurricane Helene brought some of the biggest destruction most people will ever see in their career. Right now, Texas A&M Task Force 1 is operating in Yancey County, North Carolina, but the deployment originally sent them to Florida. Today marks 13 days that Bannister and 79 others from Texas A&M Task Force 1 have been boots on the ground. Bannister wants Central Texans to have a greater understanding of what the people there are dealing with. Uh, we're seeing clips on the news and, and things like that. And those are just a min minuscule piece and we see the flooding aspect there. But what they don't really see is what the folks are going through. We're doing our best to take account of what's going on to try to locate the number of missing people and start tracking down, backtracking those and allocating resources to them as we can. Bannister says there is no running water, and if there is any power, it's coming from generators because power hasn't been restored in much of the state yet. There are also Starlinks helping with connectivity, and airdrops are bringing in necessary resources. At this point, it's unclear when the Central Texan and all the other first responders will be able to return home, but Bannister says they'll go where they are needed and they'll stay for as long as needed to. Guys. Yeah, and without that power, the video you just showed, Bailey, the destruction there is just unbelievable. Thanks for the update.